This new type of inspector came to check out this stainless steel weld. It turns out he was pretty happy with it too. So today we're going to be completing a corner joint using 316 stainless steel plate and 316 L 2.5 millimeter rods using the electrode on the positive port. So working our way down this plate, as this is thin material, we're going to be moving slightly quicker. It's also not going to help as a stainless steel likes to hold on to the heat. And as this is very thin plate, the likelihood of overheating it and blowing through is quite high. Unlike mild steel, which is a bit more forgiving. So for this joint, we're going to be using a 15 degree drag angle, keeping our rod nice and close, roughly 2 millimeters away from our pool. Just making sure that we fuse both of them edges together, trying not to travel too fast that we have missed edges. However, making sure we have the right balance, because if we travel too slow will overheat the joint and cause the weld to go flat and sink and this could also give us excess penetration blowing a hole through our root gap so we're coming to the end of this joint now here's a picture of Steve and his pretty PPE so if we've done this joint correctly we should see the root consistent all the way down the joint and if we had irregular travel speed either too much travel speed or too slow we would either see miss penetration or excess penetration so for this part make sure you've got your safety glasses on as this slag likes to ping off and potentially hit you in the eye so if this video has helped you out the video you can see on the screen now is going to go one step further and show you how to blend multiple passes known as a multi-run